guys, it's Sam here from DBL Online, and in today's video we're going to be talking about the test server patch notes. Now these were released yesterday by Ubisoft, and you guys have probably already heard a lot about this, but Jaeger got nerfed from a 3 speed down to a 2 speed 2 armor, as well as Buck is losing his nades, Kev is getting hollow, and Mossy's secondary shotgun being removed. Now let's get into the video. So first off, I'm going to be talking about the possible release date. These changes were made to the test server from the 31st, and from what we know, usually when things are added to the test servers, for example with new seasons and operators, they are released to the public on the full game two weeks following. So expect to see the update in roughly two weeks from now, and they should add in the new Mafia game mode then, I presume. If they're doing a big update, they'll do all these changes, as well as add in the new Mafia arcade game mode. Alright, so if we come down here to patch notes, and under balancing it says buck. More keys, more open doors, more opportunities, so frag grenades replaced by claymore. So that's quite disappointing because frag grenades are very iconic on buck and it kind of just suits them. So they're just, you know, the fact that they're getting rid of that is pretty sad. Now if we come down here, it says skeleton key magazine capacity. So they've increased the normal magazine capacity of 5 shells to 6, and they've increased the maximum from 25 to 26 now. So not much of a change, but it's pretty alright, I guess. And if we come down to Kvira here, they've added holographic, so Razor holographic. I don't know what they mean by Razor, but they've added holographic to her M12, so that's quite interesting. And here it says, we are listening to your feedback, thank you. Now, I don't know who's been complaining about Jaeger, but Jaeger is a very strong Roma, as they say, but they've just gone and pretty much ruined him. So, of course, nothing else has changed about him, just the fact that he's 2 speed, but now a lot of people will be sad, because he does have quite a high pick rate. But, oh well, I guess they always seem to nerf the best operators. I don't know why. Now, if we come down here to Mozzie, still a shorty. Remove the super shorty secondary, so that is his shotgun from secondary. So, as we know, they recently gave that to Castle, so they pretty much just swapped it out between the defenders, which kind of sucks. But, you know, I guess they're just making a bunch of changes to balance the game out. And for Ying, giving our girl Ying a little bit more love. So, they've increased the number of Candelas from 3 to 4. Now, I don't know why they've done this, because when she runs into the site and throws 3 of them down, that's already enough to blind the whole team. So, the fact that they've added that to 4, it's pretty ridiculous. Now, they've replaced Claymores with Smoke Grenades, so it will help out with planting, so I do like that change. Now, they've increased the LMG damage from 43 to 46. Now, her LMG, of course, is the T95 LSW. Now, if we come down here to Kaid and Goyo, so as you guys know, they have a slug shotgun, which is pretty much a sniper. So, the only alternative to the Boss G on the defending side. So, the TCSG12 added additional magazine to that, and they've reduced damage from 84 to 55. I mean, that is a lot of damage reduction, but I don't know why they've done that, but I guess it's not too bad. I mean, his weapon still would be pretty much a 2-3 shot down, so that's alright. And the final thing here is bug fixes, so they fixed all these down here. You can just pause on the video here and look at these if you want to read these over. Alright guys, so that's it for this video. Thank you for watching all the way to the end if you did. And if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like on it. If you guys are looking for more content, please check out my channel, Samsung I Am. Link will be in the description below. Now, if you're not following our social medias, please check out the TBL Online Twitter and Instagram. And if you guys aren't subscribed here to us on the TBL Online channel, please subscribe to us and put on bell notifications. Now, comment down below why you think Yubi's making these changes and if you like them or if you don't like them. And I'll catch you guys later.